Hello everybody, and welcome back. So let's see the Lord's Hunt. Oh! Motions down, people. Solve the case by accusing those who are- oh, thanks, okay. So everything... leads to this. Oh dear. Lord Marsh's cold blooded killer who under the guise of charity hunted down poor people, put Lord Marsh in jail, or people where he will eventually die from tuberculosis. What do you think Lord I should Marsh do here, man? Has no likelihood of recovering from his illness. Uh, I don't. I mean, if he, regardless, he's gonna die because of his tuberculosis. It doesn't seem to be a right or wrong choice here. What should I do, man? I I Just fucking now. hate doing this shit. Please, what is what would you do? I mean, if this is correct, then Lord Marsh, cold blooded killer, I would condemn him. <sighs> oh, there's no way of knowing for sure, is there? Probably not. Let's look it up. Do you want me to? Yes, I'm weak. I'm sorry. This everything seems to be pointing to them fucking hunting down people in the woods. Leading to them fucking, I see. D yeah, you know what? I wouldn't be surprised. There's probably a few backwoods orgies around here, you know? Getting a little fun. Should I absolve or condemn Lord Marsh? Yum. Um, looking it up has okay. taken a bit. Okay, continue the investigation. I mean, everything else points to this. Let's see, does this change anything? Ah. No return, revenge. Personal motives. Lord's hunt. So if I change all of this... No, that doesn't help. So everything points to this being the correct, uh, thing. Revenge. And then last chance. You have found and utilized all clues in the case. Please proceed to the deduction space and form your conclusion. I I guess we should condemn him, yeah. Um Click on the final bubble given decision decision to either put Marsh in prison or let his disease kill him. Regardless of what you choose, Holmes will come out of the closet with his gun, raise and Hurst will or Hurst will attempt to kill Marsh. You have a choice to shoot Marsh, shoot Hurst, or do nothing and let Hurst do what he wants. In this mm. case, the outcome doesn't matter. You can choose as you please. Alright, I guess we'll continue. Afterwards, you can replay the ending and choose the other path if you like. Oh. You can confirm your decision and uh, finish the case. Unlocking the hunter becomes the prey. Alright, condemn Lord Marsh. Confirm my moral choice? Shit! Fine, I like being the good person, so I'm gonna absolve him, okay? You do you, man. We've spent way too long on this, so... I'd condemn him. Ah! I hate this. Well, that would do. Nothing feels like the right choice. George, lower your rifle, please, for Tom's sake. Holmes. Your choice. Shoot him, my shoot Marsh. My. An almost worthy opponent. Tom? My Tom? If you've endangered my lad in any way, you will pay dearly. I assure you that Tom is safe in London with a well-trusted friend. And now, it's time to end this. By all means. George, listen to me. If you're seeking an apt punishment and vengeance, killing Marsh will give him exactly what he wants. He would die knowing that he had fulfilled his life through his absolute control of it. But, if you allow Marsh to live, he will suffer a far greater punishment. 
For his ball and chain will be the debilitating tuberculosis. Look, it's already dragging him painfully and slowly to his death. I guess then that's his true. Can yeah. and will be used to support the families affected by the Quartermain Club's malevolence. You're mad. You're both mad. Says the Let's dude hunting people Tom. in the woods. Not just yet. See, Lord Marsh, you will die here, although not by the gun. You'll die slowly. Don't do this, George. Detective, take a look here. Marsh. Marsh. Oh, dear. This is how you became sick, Lord Marsh. The beheading of your victims who were suffering from tuberculosis was what infected you. Poetic justice. Holmes, you cannot fully understand why we helped so many and sacrificed a few. But don't let me die like this. Just kill me now. Wait. Up to you. Uh, uh, you can shoot him, shoot Hurst, or do nothing. Let it happen. Oh, I don't. I didn't hit the button. Mr. Hurst, you have already served brutal <laughs> justice to Lord Harrington, and I hope Lord Collins and Doctor Fisher, taking that into consideration, <laughs> you may as well kill Lord Marsh and end the Quartermain Club completely. No loose ends. I. I feel like I'm kind of being the bad guy here. No. Uh, check conclusion. I Who's guess. Found? Found all, the clues. all right, you know what? Finish the case. Seb Kyle's was removed. No, if you would like to select another moral choice. Agree with the choice you've made. I guess so. I don't feel okay. good about the choices I've made, but the other choices wouldn't make me feel any better. I think it was good. I mean, I would condemn him regardless, but yeah. Yeah, I mean, he's already gonna die, but it's it's the it's the way you respond to it that matters, I suppose. Yep. I don't the only know. way to save him and let him uh, stew in his own slowly dying self is to kill a father. Yeah, there's no fuck. There's no fucking way I'm gonna go kill uh, what's his name, Tom? No, Tom's dad. George Hurst. Yeah, there's no way he didn't do fucking anything but avenge these victims. So yep. yeah, this why the fuck would I shoot him? Here we go. Uh. Why are you bowling? Well Done, Watson. Holmes, you're playing bowls indoors. Why? Not any old bowls, Watson? Lawn bowling. Seriously? With your injury? All oh, right. This must be like right after. Oh. Ah. Mrs. Hudson is going to murder you. Hmm. Well, that's it for now. Time to go. Would you care to join? <laughs> Wait! Oh, you're, you're right. <laughs> they actually, it's probably like classic. Like, oh yeah, Where I didn't think going, about Holmes? that. You know what? Let's I'm stop here. I'm participating in the final stage of the annual tournament held by the London Archaeological Institute's Bowling Club. Oh, you probably it's have to wear the sporting invitation. outfit. I'll just need to dress suitably, and then we can leave. So we did it. We did the. I, I kind of like this, where it's not just one great big overarching story, but it's, it's like a, a series of, of cases. I do like that. Yeah, it would be cool if it was a series of small cases, but they all interlinked into one big thing. That could be interesting. I feel like that's been done before somewhere. But oh yeah, definitely. I but it's I still enjoy that kind of stuff. Yeah, it is pretty cool. Overcoat, sailor outfit, morning gown. Best of attire, no, no. Sportswear, to the makeup table. Weak face disguise. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah, I see that one. I like that. That hat what? seems fitting. Glasses equals disguise. <laughs> oh, that's great. Oh, look at this. Oh, good. Yeah. Hmm. Do I want this one or do I want this this one? Ooh, I kind of like the bowler hat as well, but that doesn't really seem fitting for this. 
I'll, I'll go with the Sunday hat. Yeah. I, I like it. <laughs> you look like, uh, what's it called? I know exactly what you're talking about. Uh, Barbershop Quartet. Yeah. Yeah. Holmes, look, are you really like sure you want to wear that? that? This? Everyone dresses like this at the club. <laughs> that should be a sight worth seeing. I only hope I'll you go in there and everyone's fucking naked. Like that. Fuck yeah. Tally ho! Spit spot. Jolly good. A eh, what? Ah, look at this. All these filthy commoners. <laughs> All right, coach man, take me where I need to go. To the club. To the club. Here we go. Here we go. All the way to Idaho. Let's go. He's still reading that book. Practical motherhood. Yep. And parent craft. Open deductions. Fuck you. Fuck you. I wonder what this is what we're dealing with in this one. I'm going to assume they find a dead body at the club and we have to deduce who done it. We have to have a who done it in this game who done at some did it. point. If there is not a who done it at this in this game, I'll be disappointed. Like maybe they attend a fancy dining uh, dinner party. That's a cool statue. Mr. Holmes, you played very well yesterday. Oh, I'm obliged to God! I play many outdoor sports. That's the key to my success. My friend Dr. Watson has decided to join me. Really? Mr. Holmes, would you like to see the first prize? A rare stone Mayan quiche calendar. Mayan quiche? Mayan Indeed. quiche? Their oh, yum! King, Tekun Uman, has his statue just behind you. Although this one is a cast metal copy. That? Oh. Well, since only members may enter the clubhouse, we have exhibited the calendar outside. Please, explore. Okay, that's weird. I never understood the point of an exclusive club for an already exclusive club that is the upper class of London. I'd like to win the Mayan calendar. It's a beautiful work of art. Also, you... picked right. Everyone's wearing these stupid hats. <laughs> Good luck, Holmes. Oh. Oh, look, there's a thing insignia the there. Statue of Takun Man. Man. I If you look Hakuna up, you can look Hakuna at the statue itself. Hakuna Matata. What a wonderful phrase. <laughs> this is a nice fucking place, though. This is outside of the actual clubhouse itself? God damn. Yeah. Unless that's the clubhouse inside there. Either way, Arthur this is... is in the final with you know who? Mr. Sherlock Holmes! How exciting! Oh! You know what would be funny? What? Is if he wore the glasses and didn't let you in because he didn't recognize you. <laughs> this will keep Watson happy. The fuck is this? Oh, hors d'oeuvres. Eh. Just was... shit on crackers. Oh, yeah. Oh, that Whatever. continues it. Ah. ah, Mr. Holmes, are you ready oh, to begin okay. the final game? No, no. I still need some time. I'm recovering from a bullet wound, you see. Mr. Holmes, I'm glad you are my opponent for the final. People call me Arthur the Invincible, <laughs> so I wish you good luck. Is that supposed to be Arthur, Arthur the Invincible, Conan Doyle? <laughs> Mr. Holmes? Arthur Conan Doyle. Well, oh, what? Is why is how is he over here? Good luck, Holmes. But you were... You over there, dude! It's a great fight. Did you see the first prize? Where can we see that calendar? Oh, there it is. Holmes and Leebrook. Arthur Leebrook. What a spectacular season. Donovan and Holmes versus Bosworth. Arthur Lee Leebrook. The Great Tournament of the London Archaeological Institute's Bowling Club. Oh, God, the music. Can you look at the, uh, uh, can you look at the, uh... Oh, there's the calendar. Calendar? Yeah. The first prize. 
the Mayan Quiche calendar. That's a lot fucking smaller than the calendar my uh, dad and stepmom got. It was like this huge ass fucking thing. Yeah, the, that took up a like wall. the actual Mayan calendar is huge. Aha! Uh Aha! -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Oh. So, are you ready now? Oh, okay. All right. I guess that's yeah. all I can do. Yes. Let's start the fight. Aha! Uh Aha! -huh, uh -huh. Pinosh, splish, splosh. Oh, yeah, I'm gonna bowls gonna... as close as possible to the white marker bowl. I'm gonna okay. fucking ruin this. Close oh, it's to the this. white marker. What? Yeah, you're throwing the white marker first. Have you played this game in a? What's it called? I have never fucking played this in my Assassin's life. Assassin's Creed Three. Oh, that's pretty far. Oh dear. Did you I fuck up? As, you have to get everything as close to that as possible. You get the first roll. Why the hell is it curved like this? No idea. Aww. Though, and I guess we'll find out where it goes. Alleyoop! Yeah, it curves. Uh, baby! He stops there. Should have put Beat a little that, bit. Arthur, you fuck. <laughs> and not even close to me, Arthur. Better luck next time. You should just give up now. Please give up now before I lose to you. They booed him. Put a little, a little more power into it. Oh, get it slightly closer. Hey! Yep. Oh no! If it stays out of bounds, it probably does not count. Go 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 go! It's in. I think I'm gonna win. To be honest, that first roll was already pretty good, if I do say so myself. Why are people Oh no! Oh no! Get away! Get away! No, you're good. It's no. case on. Out of bounds, out of bounds. It's going out of bounds. Yep, it's out of bounds. Woo! How thrilling this game is! Okay, go a little. Oh, I can. Uh... Not too much power. I mean, I already won, mm -hmm. so it doesn't really mm -hmm. matter where I throw, right? Or is it like cumulative points? Oh, it's a cumulative. Fuck! He still has two more balls. If you can get them closer than yours, we got then big he wins. Balls. We got Let's big see. Balls. No. Who's got the biggest I think you're gonna win this. Balls of one of them is all. out of bounds. Okay, not too much power. Yeah! Oh, yeah, that's good. Yeah, he won. <laughs> More really closer to it than theirs. Let's see. Wait, this is only round one. Fuck. Which means. Oh, no. Oh, no. Go away. No. No. Ooh, you right on it. Fucking son of a bitch. Oh, no, it's still going. Oh, thank God. I win. And you win. Oh, thank God. Fuck you. Yeah, he had more close to it than he did. Next round. Aha. Uh -huh. Now you can choose where it goes. Hi -ya! It also depends on how difficult you want it to be. Uh, okay, I think that's decent. Right, first roll. Yes. Close in on it. Close in on it. Oh, I did too far to the left. Oh. What a thrilling game this is, Watson. And then. 
I wonder if you skip will skip this whole thing or I think so. Or it's giving me the around. Which is kinda weird. It's giving me the option to skip everything so far. Yeah. You can skip the puzzles. That's weird. Oh well that's all the time we have for today. Thank you for watching and we'll see you later. Adios.